Hi, I'm Andrew Schmitz. I'm a researcher here at G Global Research, and we're doing a series of blogs for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. This week, we're talking about breast density. I have a few sets of images here that I want to use to illustrate some of the points that I spoke about in the blog. Um, shown here on the screen is uh, an example of what are low density mammograms. These are two separate women, and this is an example of a, of a fat, what is considered a fatty breast. The second set of images, you can start to see some of the scattered densities showing up. The white cloudy structures that are in here are densities that are starting to um, be seen in this type of image. Here's a set of heterogeneously dense mammograms. Again, look at um, the composition of the breast. You can start to see um, more of the white um, structures showing up. And then finally, an extremely dense mammogram. It's important to remember that um, typically younger women will have denser breasts. And as women age, their, their density of composition will change to be somewhere in between. High density is not a guarantee that you're going to develop breast cancer. But it's important to remember that it could cause problems for traditional screening methods. So it's an, an important conversation to have with your doctor. I want to finish off by thanking the researchers at the University of Michigan who provided these images for us. And hope you have a great day.